What it do, gang? It's your boy Mike. I'm back with another video. Real quick, for all y'all that's new to the channel, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, turn on all post notifications. And other than that, let's get to this lit content of all these cars at this car show. It's about to go. All right, gang, look, straight out the car, parked right across from me. This S2000. Let's check it out. Big boy. Look at that. And they're cooler down there. Look at that carbon fiber. Big boy. Got the hood pins that lock down in. You see them? Nasty. Look at this. Big ass turbo in there. Look how huge that thing is. Jesus. Little S2000. Getting it. But this little thing's fast as hell. That's nice right there. That's real nice. Fourth anniversary Mustang. It's motherfucking nasty for real. Somebody pulling up. You see it? You see it, guys. Fortieth anniversary. Nice. But we we come to check out the C8. The C8 is definitely doing it. Look at that. This movie would look like a 2LT. He got the back painted. Look at that. That's so nasty. I love these two. See, see the fence right here that's open? See them? It's crazy, isn't it? These things are so nasty. Nice right there. This type bar is sick. Look at this fucking wing. Jesus. Man. We just open the hood of the super. This is my man. This motherfucker is nasty. Look at all this carbon fiber. Man. Look at that. <laughs> that motherfucker is nasty right there. We gonna go over here and check these other shit out, guys. I'm gonna get right back to you as soon as we get over here. What's up, guys? We back in this little Porsche right here. It's clean, a little slick with the bronze wheels. 987S. It's nasty. Carbon fiber fan on the back. Yeah, for sure. Big blue brakes. Grill. Rotors. Nasty. Got a scatty right here. Daytona scat. It's so fucking nice. Super clean Daytona scat pack. You see it. Daytona. Got the big boy 
the SRT Brimbos with the Pirellis. Clean. And all that checkered in tire. Yeah, that motherfucker nice. You see this, guys? They got the, the matte black across the back. Matte black roof. Matte black down the center of the hood with the Hemi. You see it. 392, 392. Look boy, nasty right here. You see it, Daytona. All right guys, we gonna head over here to the other shit. I see an RT charger right here. Oh, he just started him up. Colt starts sound nasty. He got the wicker bill on the back of his shit. At the bottom, and that bitch, that boy, nasty for sure. Look at that, look at that big pipes. That motherfucker is nasty. He got the regular hood, but you see it 345 Hemi. This is just a regular 57 Hemi. I thought it was a scatty. Hell no, that's a 57. That bitch nasty. Got the C7 right here. Look at all the carbon fiber. That motherfucker nasty. Got the carbon fiber all the way down the side. Side skirts. Got the carbon fiber spoiler. That thing nice for real. We got an old school Chevy right here. This slam, this motherfucker nice right here. This thing super clean right here. This Silverado super clean. Oh, you see, you got the paddle shifter for the up, down. See them paddle shifters? This motherfucker nasty. Is this one of yours? Yeah, it's mine. What do you got in it? Uh, it's a, it's if you don't mind. The LS. LS4. Uh, just a, just a 5.3. Yeah, I, uh, hey, I think they're L33. Okay. I think they were like LS4 blocks or something. Oh, I'm not for sure. My, my Impala's got a 5.3 in it, and it's an LS4. So okay, I, the front wheel drives were LS4s. Right, This right. is an L33. Okay, yep. Out of, like, like an 05 Silverado. Yep, out of the, it's the same motor, but just labeled a little different. <laughs> yeah, like the Trailblazers and stuff, I think were, were L, LS4s too. It's the Silverados that were different, just like the one tons and stuff that had the bigger idea. crank in them I think it's nice though definitely nice I'd love to have an old truck like that man thanks buddy look at this this old old stingray my dad used to have one of these it's an L82 it's just like my dad's man yeah we ain't gonna get into the story of why my dad sold his but <laughs> He definitely sold it to help me out and kick and cusses me out every day. You know, I was in a bad spot. About to do about 50 years. So Pops was like, man, we, we talked with the lawyer. He flat out said, like, look, if I sell this, he better get under 10. And so sure enough, I got six years. The lawyer was a beast, but you see it, four speed, big boy. These things ain't got no room in the back, especially these. You see how they got the flat window in the back? So, my dad's had the big back window, so you had a little more room in the back. And one thing is right here behind the seat, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a spot right behind the seat right here where the battery goes. And it's a bitch to get to it. It's got the side pipes, factory rallies. You see this little key lock right here on the side, right beside the Stingray? That's actually, you unlock them, and that's what folds the front, or, or unlocks it so you can fold the hood up to, you know what I mean, pop the hood on the car. Another Type R, nothing special. We got a big boy Beamer down here. So we'll go check this Beamer out. It's a big boy Beamer. I'm sleeping on this. M6, it's a big boy. It's the big boy beamer right here. Yeah, this bitch nasty. 
Ooh, got the burgundy interior. Six six speed it look like. Yeah. This got the heads up display. You see it. M6. Big boy beamer. Then they got an M4 right here in front of it. Both white. Nasty. Super nasty. We got another GTO pulling up. That bitch sounds so good. You hear that motherfucker? Boy. That motherfucker ready to hurt somebody's feelings. Alright. Now you see this line right here? We about to start down here at this vet. C7. Got another 5.0 right here. That motherfucker nice. He got, he got the racing seats with the bars in it. Ooh, look at that ZR, ZR1 right there. Nasty. We're going to go ahead and get to this C7 right here, guys. This motherfucker is nasty. Yes, it is. Oh, my God. Pretty amazing. Man, the way they crammed that shit down in there is crazy. <laughs> yeah. Green belt on it. Man, that's that so fast. I'd settle for one of them. For, man, yeah. I'd love to have a C8, but I'd settle for one of these. They just they, the mid engine has better yeah, uh, they, handling. Yeah, they talk about the way they handle, the way that they that's so sealed in there, like it just. It's crazy. It's a pain to work on, though. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. But, you know, you get that with a lot. Oh, yeah. It, it comes with the territory of the toys. Oh, yeah. This thing is so sick. Look at these big-ass vents. That thing is sick. Is it, this was the one that was just over there? Huh? This was just over there? No. The one. <laughs> I'm like, man, I thought I'd just film this one. Oh, yeah, it's got the darker blue than that one was, I think. This thing is nasty. Mm, mm, mm. Another Daytona. Hemi, hemi, hemi. You see it. Daytona. Scat. No badges. Is it 392 or? It's an RT. RT? Man, that looks nice. Nice. Look at the way Ford look at superchargers. They're funny as hell. Funny build. Yes. I can say, man, I like the new Ford. And I'm not even a fan, but it's got that big whipple supercharger on it. Them motherfucking superchargers are monsters, bro. You see the double pulley action on it, right? Wow, and it's got the tensioner there and a tensioner there. It keeps super tension on that belt. What did it say? 3.75 size belt. They dropped that motherfucker pulley down, so that motherfucker really come to life. But I'm sure they got it where they want it. We're going to walk on up, check out a couple things. This old ass Porsche right here. This thing's crazy. It's old. It's funny how they used to look. Look at that. I'd be so glad oh, to Ferrari. I'm so, no, it's a Porsche. I'm tripping. Another old motherfucking Porsche. Silverado I got last week, I think. Rams. Nasty. Man. It's a T-Rex, baby. A TRX. That thing's so sick. You see that big boy screen in there? You can't see it because of the motherfucking thing. You can see it now. It's T Rexes. TRX is nasty. Can you see? He got the short bed on it. Whatever. I don't know. This one looked different than Buzz. This thing, you see it. T Rex. Big. Ram CRX supercharged Hellcat version of the truck. That motherfucker's so sick. That thing nasty. Then we got a Hellcat. No. Oh. Big boy Hellcat badge. You see it? 
six speed six speed Hellcat that's hard to find it's crazy you see it guys right there big boy Red seats, six feet. Six feet. That motherfucker's nice. Damn, I thought I stopped that. I must have been talking the whole time. Oh well. Let's check out this right here. G8. This thing nasty. Come on, man. Got Camaro wheels on him. But you can get them caps in Pontiac. They're the same standard cap. Buddy. This R8. Or, uh, R8. G8 is nasty though. And these things run crazy. They got. They get it. They got the same motor mine. my Impala got sent it though. I think. I think. I could be wrong. But I think it's got the 5.3 LS4 in it. This thing right here is nasty. I think I got this last week. Got the wicker bill on it. SRT. Yeah, this thing's nasty. Got that red interior. SRT seats. You see the carbon fiber right there? You see it. You see it. This thing's nice. Real nice. This is 65, 66, maybe. I'm gonna go look at these tail lights. I could tell you more at the tail light. Can't really tell you off that the front, but I could tell you off the tail lights a little better. I still could be wrong. Got the white top. You see it? This thing's huge. Oh, that's like a 67, 68, maybe. I don't know. Little Civic. I'm assuming it's an SI. D badge, so you don't know. Another Civic, another Civic. Type R with a temp tag. But hey, ain't nothing wrong with bringing that big in here. You see it. You know that carpet fiber all the way down the side. Oh five oh. Rolling 5-0. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. This is the old Menace Society ride. We got another C8. Check him out. That bright ass orange. Look at it. Again, got the yellow brakes. C51 brakes, but this one got the peanut butter guts. Peanut butter guts with the orange seatbelts to match. This thing is crazy nasty. Stingray got the hard top to come off. He got the back of his shit open though. You feel me? Look at this. Look at this, guys. This shit is crazy. This is nasty. Oh, you see how the intake goes backwards? You see it right there? The intake goes towards the back of the cars, which comes around and vents in from here. Right here, these vents on the side. You see them? That vents up here through the quarter comes around and sucks into the motor. Nasty, bro. Nasty. Got that. <sighs> Look, it got like a pearl flake in the brakes. I don't know if you guys can see that. The brake calipers. Look at this interior with that sun beaming on it. Got the fat symbol there. We're gonna go over here and check the CL1 out real quick. Got this 
ZL1. them front ends look man it's crazy we got a c06 c7 right here nasty you see he got the slicks on him this thing is off the chain this thing is so nasty oh my god this thing This thing is crazy. You see it. Z06 supercharged. You see it. We got another Mero. Ooh, somebody scuffed him. That have been a beat down. Can't see. Oh, automatic. I can't tell. Is this a V6? Well, I think it's a V6. Any little putt, putt, putt. No, no. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Got there a couple of D's the other day. They ain't really nothing to look at. Oh yeah, I am. I am. I'm gonna cut back up this memo section. I'll meet you guys in a second. What did it do, guys? Check this little thing out. I think it's one of them little Morgan things again. Check him out. <laughs> Check him out riding. You gotta like duck down just to be under the windshield. It's crazy. Look at the detail on this, guys. Look at this. You see it? You got the belts. The belts are strapped. That's how they hold the hood down. This shit crazy. You know they was a little backwards back in the day. The oil filter is upside down. <laughs> It'd be like that. It'd be like that. We got this G8 right here. It's the one I was looking at over there, I think. Nope, there's a different one over there. Okay then, okay then. He got the same wheels though. With the Camaro caps, man, come on, man. They the same, pop them out. Big boy, pop them out. He got a wicker bill he made for his. Tell he made it. It looked like he don't got the spoiler cell phone or something. I don't get it. He did something different with his. I mean, it's nice and all, but... I don't know how to replace some headlights in, though, foggish. But that hood, though, it's aggressive. This little thing's cool. Little Fiat. <laughs> we got the Hellcat. Got the cat in the bag. He got the cat in the bag. <laughs> You see it. Don't touch my shit. He said, Don't touch my shit. Hey, oh, whoops. You see it. He got the carbon fiber. You see it. Carbon fiber. It's nice. It's definitely nice, nice. You see it. He got the tail lights blackened out. He got these little carbon fiber covers over his pipes. I don't like him, though. Yeah, I don't like him. He got the carbon fiber spoiler. He got the spots to put the wicker bill. He need to put the wicker bill. He tripping. He got the diffuser down there. It looks like it's a little pop, popped out right here. Like, like, like they ain't get it in all the way or something. You feel me? I don't know. See him right there? Look like it's popped out. But it's all good in the hood. You know what I'm saying? It's still a $70,000 car at the end of the day. You feel me? You see it. You got the, all that. Got the red pedals in there. Yeah, he got it. You see it. Yeah, you see it. He got the cat in the bag. Wait, I went. You talking about what they do? Not the actual IFO meet, but like the preview or something. That 
shit. Got the white badge. I went to the. I went to the. With the white badges. Guys, I don't want to miss nothing, but I really fucking need something to drink. You see this thing? Again, got the got the lock hood pins on the t type or nasty carbon fiber out. Boom, 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 boom. Got it there. Boom. Got the door handle. Boom. The little pads, pads inside the door panel. He carbon fiber out. He got it going on right now, baby. Another S2000. What a new game. We're back. We're about to get back to this recording. Get you this content. Something got it. Alright, I got me some, some hydration in me. We're about to get back to this lake content real quick. We got it. Check him out. Carbon fiber. Where the, where the cookies at? You see it? Cookie time. You sit over here. All right, thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna walk down. I'm gonna go there first. Then I'm gonna come back and get this 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 Hellcat MSCA for you in just a second. I'm gonna walk down here and check out these cookies. It's cookie time. What's she say? Her son say it's cookie time. It's cookie time. Oh, let me check this out real quick. Ooh, we got the whole bottom open on that. Big wood. wood. Ooh, got the old rat rod. Look. Man, oh man. Look at this thing for you guys right here. Big boy hemispherical motor. Man, oh man. Let me tell you. That thing is pretty. I just want to hear it start. You hear the electric fan kick on? Get the big air breather on top of the carb. Big boy. This thing about to sound real good when he hit that pet. Man, watch him. Check him out. Check him out. Get it, old man. That motherfucker is nasty. He wouldn't rev it, though. It's all good. I'm gonna be right back, guys. I'm gonna check this out. I'm back. I had to take a quick break. You see, Girl Scout cookies. Big Girl Scout cookies. I had to grab some. You know the kids at home, they gonna love the Girl Scout cookies. So I had to get them and support the Girl Scouts. You know what I mean? It ain't nothing. It's a couple dollars and it helps the kids that's trying to do something great. You know what I'm saying? Another Z06 right here for you guys. Ooh. Like that, you know what I'm saying? 
You've probably seen them blue with the carbon fibers. Like, fuck it, let me grab them. Yeah. Can't do that, big dog. You gotta send them to the paint shop. Had them painted to match. Actually, if you look, they kind of look like he painted them. Put it in, use the paint coat. Slipping. You ain't gonna win no awards with that one, baby. Look at this Hellcat over here. Two tone matte Hellcat. What it do? You see it right there. Hellcat. That's the thing over there. You know, he got the slickies on the back. Yes, sir. You see it. You see it. Big boy Hellcat badge. I've yet to see a red eye here, y'all. Pull up on the red eye. He got his thing popped out. Don't got that one. But what it do? You see it? Big Hellcat badge. You see it? The green with the red all matte. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go around here and see if this is still here. Ooh, I think he left on me. Some bitch. It's a bright blue skater. He skirted on me. I had to go get them Girl Scout cookies. You see, I done missed the footage of the CA. But it's all good, you guys. You know, it ain't nothing. It happens. I'll catch him another time. You know what I mean? We got a V-Series caddy over here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. These things is nice. What do you say? Dragon ass with class. <laughs> I like that. I'm gonna have to steal that. I'm gonna have to steal. Oh. I just kid. I just kid. Sure. Another little Morgan or whatever. MG. It's an MG. MG, look at the wood back in the day. Look how crisp that wood was back in the day. I'm gonna grab this Pontiac for you guys, but I'm not gonna let y'all see what the badges say because I want y'all to put down in the comments what it is. What kind of Pontiac is this? Please, somebody, if you know, let me know. I wanna know what kind of Pontiac. I know what it is. My daddy had one years ago. I know what kind of Pontiac it is. But for you guys, put down in the comments what kind of Pontiac it is. But this original with the eight lug wheels. You know how hard it is to find them eight lug wheels? You guys have no idea. It is like impossible to find them eight lug wheels. Check him out. Check him out. Man, oh man. Alright, y'all. I can't do it no more because it's blocking out footage. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and let y'all know what it is. I can't not show it to y'all because I'm blocking out parts of the car by not letting y'all see what it is. It's a 63 gram pre 8 lug car. Wow. Check him out. Look at that fucking front end. That motherfucker is disgusting. Only got the one mirror on the side. You see it? Yep, you see it. And like I said, a motherfucking lug wheels, bro. I'm not playing with y'all. Y'all see them lugs around here? Yes. A lug. It's a hundred thousand dollar car, y'all. Y'all even fucking know that? No, y'all don't. So I don't know about this shit. I'm trying to tell y'all. This thing is the nastiest car here. The whole car show. By far the nastiest car here. But I'm gonna keep going and get y'all some more lit content. Let's go. We got the SS, the red SS right here. This motherfucking nasty. Yeah, you see it. The red SS. Licked up. You see it. Yes, sir. Blicky, blicky. This guy got the whole carbon fiber hood. I don't know why these guys keep pulling around so many cars. Try to get more people to look at them. This one dude I just seen him moving his shit, moving his shit. 
Let's try to get people. Ooh, we. What do we have here? We got the SRT Grand Cherokee. You see it. Got the print balls on it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at this. <laughs> yes, sir. Track motherfucking hawk. Jesus, that was that fucking C.A. That's that C.A. leaving. And some other guys. Anyways, we got that cheap SRT here. It's not a track hawk. Because it would say track hawk. But it's definitely an SRT. Probably got the 392 in it or something. I don't know. I don't know much about these. I think it do because see how big the exhaust is. See, it's SRT8. It's probably a 392. But I'll take it. It's the motherfucking nasty. It's the nasty. Getting it leaving, boy. Giving her hell. Look at this C8 right here. This the Grand Sport. It's not a Stingray. It's a Grand Sport. But I think this thing right here. Other, uh, I like the yellow one back there. But other than that yellow one, I think this might be the best choice of the night. On the C8 vet side. Like. Fuck. Real quick, we're gonna we'll, we jump back to this in a second. But you got the Scatty in orange and the Hellcat in blue. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Let's try to see if we can catch it real quick. Driving the scat, them motherfuckers is nasty. Boy, boy, boy. All right, now let's get back to the C8. It's a whole different type of monster over here. You feel me? It's a grand sport. Yes, sir. You see it. You see it. Super red guts. Bloody, bloody guts. Yes, sir. Look, everybody done went out to the road because motherfuckers going out there getting it, you hear me? They tripping though. They blowing the spot up. Let me scan real quick the old Ferrari over there. I'm going to check the rest of these out in a second, guys. I'm going to walk up here to the road. I'm going to be like everybody else and try to catch an eyeful of these things going down the road here. You hear me? Oh, look at the old V-Dub van with the roof raised because we'll make it a tent. Make it a big camper. Look, got the little kids up there. You see them? You see them up there? I know you see them up there. I know you see them up there. Yes, sir. Damn it, man. I missed that cat leaving. I'm trying to show y'all the van, show y'all some content. I done missed that cat, the hell cat, and that scatty leave. Go ahead. Go ahead, boss. Go ahead. I ain't in no hurry. Come on, come on. You see it, what it do, what it do. I knew I was gonna miss him, that's why I was walking so quick. Ooh, we, I don't even know what that is, guys. But drop in the comments and tell me what kind of car that is. Damn, guys, I missed that Hellcat and that scat get on it leaving because I stopped at this damn van that I knew I could come back and get for you in a minute. It is all good, though. It definitely happens. It be like this sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Get the little bite. What it do? What it do? Oh, 
No, I think they got somebody down there ready to go. You feel me? We waiting on somebody. I don't know who. I don't know where. I'm just a spectator. You feel me, guys? I'm not for sure what's going on out here. I just come out to the road to watch. Like everybody else. I'm trying to get an eye for it. We're we'll trying to get in this little baby. <laughs> Break the tires loose. What a shame. What a shame. My ass tend to get busier than that. We got a 5 0 pulling out, guys. <laughs> Come on, man. That little Civic could have did better than that. There we go. Oh, he ain't going to okay. get it. Oh, he's scared of it. got another little SI pulling out, I think. I think it's an SI. You see it down there, guys? The little green one. You see it. You see it. He coming out. He coming out. Smoking like a freight train. Ooh, C7. Wicker bill. And the fuse on the back. That thing nasty. There we go. We got that feast here. He cannot drive, guys. He cannot drive. Ooh, we got that white baby pulling out. Ooh, we. Let's see. Seven. Ooh, we. C7 Grand Sport. That's the one I just looked at. And I, and I know y'all gonna give me hell. Because I know I said C8. But I meant C7. I was so distracted by that Hellcat and that Scat Pack. I was distracted with the hell I was saying. So, let's retract my previous statement. It was not a C8. It was a C7. And I'm sorry. I believe more and more people is leaving. Because it's supposed to be over at noon. You know what I'm saying? It's 11.30. But I ain't too worried about getting the footage of them driving away. I'd rather get the up close footage of it so y'all can see the detail on each individual car. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna go over here and try to catch these other cars left in the parking lot real quick for y'all. And when we're done, we'll walk back out to the road and get whatever we can leave it at that point. But for now, we walking over here. I'm gonna turn it right back on when I get to the footage. I just walked up on this old school Packard. I'm about to get y'all some footage of it. This thing is disgusting. And you see the old schools. This, this riding it, old school, because it's old school. Hang on, I'm gonna walk up in one second and let these guys get their pictures real quick. Taking some pictures, and let them get their pictures so I don't walk up in it. Excuse me. This thing is beautiful. Oh my God. You see how straight that side is? Oh my God. This was a brand new car when my, my grandma was born. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, hang on. Okay, I think he might be done. Let me let me get it for you. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. This thing is beautiful. It looks a little goldish from the hood reflecting up, but I think it's chrome. I think it looks a little gold right here, like from the hand of touching it to open the hood. That wore it down a little bit, but other than that thing, that, that man, this thing is spotless gang look at this interior look at this you see the dust back there on the seat where all it do is sit he had to have rebuilt this he probably still looking for a radio i'm sure which is fine it ain't no big deal he come up with a sun Ooh, that was that motherfucking hellcat that two-tone green and black pulling out these guys don't know how to drive because i give them hell pulling out Ooh we. One more time, let my guy get get the rest of his pictures so I can get in there. Look at that. 51 Packer. This thing is beautiful, guys. Man, oh man. We got a Magnum here. Sweet and sassy. What it do? What it do? What it do? 
It's alright. I like it. I like the hood. But I don't like that bullshit thing they put in the middle. We got another M5. Beamer. I think that's an M2, M4. So scared. So scared. Watch out. Got them over here. A couple Subaru. We got the STI right here. Yes, sir. Oh, wait, we got a stinger right here. A Kia stinger. Look at all that carbon fiber, y'all. These things right here are fucking nasty. Nasty. Got the Borla exhaust. You see the sticker. All that carbon fiber. Carbon fiber mirrors. Look at this thing. This thing is nasty. Look at this thing. Man, oh, man. This thing is freaking nasty big boy twin turbo man that thing is nasty then you got this baby right here right beside it another stinger he ain't got the hood popped on his but these Kia stingers are freaking nasty y'all you see the roof look at that roof man listen to it listen to it he got the boilers on it too. Listen to it. That thing is nasty, y'all. Fuck with them motherfuckers, boy. Here we go. One more. You see the roof. I like the black on top of this. This this red. It's like a candy red. You see it? Look at that red in the light. Look at that. Yes. Got another one over right here. Stick it up. This red is just phenomenal. But these wheels on this, look at this. You see that red on? Tell me them wheels wouldn't be nasty on this. But I know why he got them. Because you see he got the red guts inside. You see them? Big red guts. Man, these stingers are ridiculously nasty, bro. I can't even say nothing. They're all-wheel drive twin turbo. I'm telling y'all, look at this old V dub. Yes, sir, this old V dub is chopping it up. <laughs> Get him, boys. Oh, we got a couple working on the old Stustang. Stustang. That's why you gotta work on them all the time. That's why I don't like them. Another little Volkswagen. Getting it in. Look at that. Look at the little shelf down there to put your shit on. That's cool. That's super cool. We got the white wheelchair. The thing's nasty. I'm steady hearing cars get it out there, guys. I'm going to go up this last row over here. And then we're going to walk up front and see what kind of footage we can catch up here. You hear me? Look, another stinger over here. Bro, these things are so freaking nasty, man. So nasty. Anybody in their right mind that got money and need to buy one of these. Because these things are freaking nasty. I want one. And I'm going to buy one just because. Freaking nasty, bro. I love the look of them, all that, and they all wheel drive, twin turbo, man, look at this though, we got the big body Lincoln, the big body Continental with the old knockoffs on it, oh, we got a scatty right here with the shaker hood, you see it, scat pack, you see him, look at that, with the shaker hood, I love them shaker hoods y'all, Ain't nothing like it. Nothing like it. He ain't got his things popped out. He didn't pop them out, get that air in there. I mean, he got the shaker hood, the straight port. But still, he had to pop them out. It looks so much sicker. He got the roof with the matte black running down the top. You see it? You see it? Yes, sir. I don't know what this thing is. Old school Morgan. That's what I was going to say. But I wasn't going to put myself out there if I didn't know. You see how they shut that hood? They got these little levers right here. Little levers. But then they got the big boy belt. Leather belt holding the hood shut. That's what I'm talking about. Man, oh man. This one right here. We checked this one out last week. This thing right here. But we got this twin right beside it. Yes, sir. Got the top down on this one. You see it. See the number four in the grill. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
this is a right hand drive baby though you see it steering wheel on the right side guys i'm not capping i'm not making this up you see it right there yes sir yes sir Couple little more over here. This little Morgan's kind of cool. We got the basket on the back. This thing's nice. And this over here. Uh, this is Buckeye Trump TR6. I don't know what it is. But this thing's kind of cool. It's definitely kind of cool. Yes, sir. Then we got another Mustang over here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And then this. What is this? I don't know what this is. They got no badges on the front. It's an old Jaguar. Look at all that carbon fiber in there. This is the old Jaggy. Hoo wee. Yes, indeed. Jaguar on the scene. Mm mm mm. Get them, boys. Get them. That motherfucker is nasty. Okay, we check this out. We're going to go check out. These little vans over here, real quick for y'all. Check out these uh, Volkswagen vans. The one I was trying to record, but that Scat Pack leaving or the Hellcat leaving distracted the shit out of me. So we can go back over here and check it out. But if y'all watch the whole video, y'all see earlier when I was checking it out, you can see the kids up in the top in the tent living it up. Okay, but that was on a green one. We got a red one too. So we go check them both out right now. I'm gonna bring you this content of these Volkswagen vans with the tin on the top. You see it? It got the tin up top. What'd it do? Look at that. You flip the little thing down, make it a whole bed up there. You can just throw your kids up there and tell them to leave you there alone. Oh, we got it popped all the way in. Yes, sir. Volkswagen van van wagon. See, they got the Xbox in there, iPhone back there, big thugging. You see it, you see it, big roof, all that. You see it, definitely you see it. All right, all right, here we go. And then remember when we we seen the kids in it earlier? See how they they can pull the tent up and block it off so y'all can't see it. That's why. He got the car's eyes on it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This thing is crazy. You got, you got, you got the drains for the, for the sink and stuff. You see it. This thing is nasty. You see it? It's crazy, ain't it? It's super crazy. <laughs> that thing's nasty. Check him out. He got the wall with the little compartments and stuff. Westy, they call him Westy, obviously. Westy. It's that, 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 man, that thing with them boilers, that, that stinger, that thing is so nasty, y'all. This, this GTO right here, bro, when he pulled up, when dude pulled up, man, that shit was so freaking loud. For a GTO, it was surprising. I'm not gonna lie. You got the 300 right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You see it? You see it? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got an R6 right here. A little bike. It's all right. I used to ride them. Don't know more ever since I laid him down. He used to tell me, don't get scared. Don't get com too comfortable. The minute you get too comfortable, shit will happen. And I definitely did that. Yeah, I seen it. Don't look like it though, it's clean. I know he waiting on it. Watch it. Show. I'm in the truck on the way back to the crib. 
You know what I'm saying? I gotta get back home and change, put some work clothes on, because I gotta finish getting the Impala back together. The wheel bearing was bad. You know what I'm saying? So I tore it apart, put a new hub on it, new hub bearing, hub assembly, whatever you wanna call it. And the motherfucker is so seized up to the axle, it will not come out, y'all. I'm trying to tell you. I've been working on cars for 20 plus years. Ever since I was a kid and my daddy was doing it. Actually longer than that. I've been doing this shit for almost 30 years. And my daddy was a mechanic. You know what I'm saying? So he taught me a lot of things. I've worked at dealerships, GM dealerships, car lots, a bunch of shit. I've worked on cars forever. So I know every trick there is to get this shit separated. You know what I'm saying? Normally, you unbolt the hub assembly, you take the nut off for the axle, leave the nut at the, on the axle at the very end of it, hit it once or twice with a sledge, but you leave the nut on there so you don't mushroom the end of the axle or mess up the threads. Hit it with the sledge once or twice, it, twice it'll pop loose in the, in the uh, hub assembly, and then you just slide the hub assembly out. Slide a new one on, bolt it all back up. Well, in this case, it won't separate, y'all. I've heated it up with a torch. I've used my fucking 10 pound sledge. The bitch won't separate. All it's doing is fucking the old bearing up. So I took a puller, like a, a like a three arm puller. You know what I'm saying? A little three arms with the bolt in the middle. It's a five ton puller. I used it, clamped it on, you know, around the, the uh, wheel bearing. Ran the bolt in the center on the, the shaft of the axle. And I heated the center of the wheel bearing up where the axle comes through with the torch to where it was glowing fucking red and tighten that bitch down and all it did was the, the, the part of the hub assembly the front the round part where the lug nut studs are where the wheel bolts to it bent bro and that shit is like half inch stain or got half inch uh fucking stainless steel or Whatever the fuck it is, galvanized metal is shit's hard as fuck. You know what I mean? It definitely don't bend, especially not like that. And it bent on all where the where the little arms that a puller was. It bent on all of them. So now, and it's right by where the studs are. So now it's supposed to be round, like you know what I mean, round like this. Now it's like bent here, bent down here. It's got like three spots. It's bent outwards like this. So. You try to put the wheel on the wheel won't even slide all the way on the studs because the way it's bent it's got the studs angled some so you can't even put the wheel on it and, and have it flush mount and bolt up so I, I can't even put my car back together it's sitting there on a jack stand and I have to figure out a solution if I can't get it to separate I can't get it you know what I mean off the spindle because the axle comes through the back and the, the hub bearing goes from the front of the spindle so it's like the axle stuck through the spindle into the bearing so if I can't get it separated, I'm going to have to pull the spindle and axle out and replace the wheel bearing, the spindle, and the axle. All just trying to replace the little fucking wheel bearing that don't take no more than 30, 45 minutes to do. This shit is ridiculous, y'all. I'm trying to tell you. Anyways, guys, I'm fixing to pull up at the crib right now. And I'm going to get out and show y'all what I'm talking about since it's sitting right here in the driveway on the jack stand. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. I'm here. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what I'm talking about real quick with this damn thing. See, if you look at it, like I said, the axle comes through the center of the hub. This is the hub right here. You see it? This part. This is the spindle. Axle comes through. Hub bolts onto it this way. All right. Now look. I don't know if y'all can see it in the video, but if you look down right here, see it? See how the metal goes and then like bows out I don't know if y'all can see it in the video but this side's been it's been down here in here so now the studs are angled so the wheel don't want to go flush on it because this is sticking out you know they're sticking out over here and here and here so it won't fu go flush and if I can't separate it I'm gonna have to remove this spindle in order I'm gonna have to remove the spindle in order and pull the axle out and replace the axle, the spindle, and the wheel bearing. You know what I'm saying? It kind of sucks, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It happens. Don't everything always go as planned when you try and plan it certain ways. You know what I'm saying? But 
it's all good. I'm going to have it back together hopefully today or tomorrow. Uh, I'm probably going to go in here and change. Just put some work clothes on, go to the junkyard. And try to see if I can't find a spindle from the junkyard since it's all a hard part. There's no movable parts, none of that. It's all a hard part. You can't get a bad one. You know what I'm saying? And then I'll just go and buy a brand new axle for it. That way the axle's brand new, the wheel bearing's brand new, and the spindle, like I said, it's a hard part. So it don't really matter if it's a used one from the junkyard or not. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, that's what I got planned for today, guys. Uh, We're going to just leave it with that. And like I said in the beginning of the video, you know, please, please, y'all, for me, help me try to get this channel going like it needs to be. Please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and make sure you hit that notification bell and turn on all post notifications. And if you like the video, please share it. Share it with your friends, share it with Facebook, share it with whoever. You know what I'm saying? Please, for me. And I will continue to try to give y'all good content. It might not be as much right now as normal people do, you know what I'm saying? But it's just starting to warm up, so car shows and stuff is just starting to come back. Now, the one we was at today, it's every weekend for the next couple months. So every Saturday, I'm going to go to that car show and make sure I get y'all some content. I am trying to find other things throughout the week that I can go to and get y'all some content. If I do, y'all will see the post. If I don't, just make sure you look forward to seeing a video from the car show. The car show's on Saturday. I should have a video up Saturday night, Sunday at the latest. But in due time, as it warms up and more car shows come, I will start posting videos every single day. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, you know, this is your boy KF Mike Sliding from Columbus, Ohio. You know what I'm saying? Again, subscribe, like, turn on all post notifications, and share with your friends if you like the video. And with that, I'm going to end this video and get on to the rest of my day. Gang!